Hey everybody, it's Mystic, and I just wanted to do this quick little um, preface before I start this episode. Um, I'm actually recording this after I've recorded this episode, so you may notice a discrepancy in the level, but that's neither here nor there. I just wanted to let you know that as of the end of this episode, Earthbound is going to be moving to Twitch as a live stream. So after this episode goes up, um, I'm actually going to be posting a bunch of them in quick succession because I want to get everybody caught up with where I'm at. And we'll just be picking up where we left off. So in case you're wondering, that's what's going to be happening with it. And I will post a link to my uh, Twitch channel down below if you want to watch it live there. It'll most likely be at 10 a.m. EDT. Uh, at least for now, until my kids start um, summer summer vacation, which will be in like a month and a half. So that'll change then. But until then, it'll be 10 a.m. EDT at my Twitch channel a couple times a week. I don't really have a schedule at the moment, but yeah. So I'll see you guys there at the end of this episode. Like I said, this will be the last one on YouTube. All right, well, let's start the episode. All right, we're all saved. Got Mara. Guess that means we are heading back through this forest and I'm, I'm so many levels higher now that it shouldn't be too bad. I hope. Mara might get dead, but we'll see. Now I just have to remember how to get out of here. Oh, hi. Oh, I didn't even see the little UFO there. Wait, teddy bear? What? Did not work on the teddy bear. Wait, what teddy bear? So is the teddy bear like our tank? What is happening right now? Because neither of us are getting hurt, and I'm not going to complain. <laughs> oh, hey, okay. Now this should have leveled both of us up. Yep. Nice, okay. Yep, okay, we're gonna probably get a bunch of levels. Sci fire. Oh boy, okay. Yeah, she's getting a bunch of levels. Five. I wonder how many levels we got. Oh, we got a, we got quite a few. I mean it's still not gonna save her if she gets hit though. Is that what the teddy bear is for? I don't even see what the teddy bear's stats are. Uh, I think I have to go up? I mean, I'm doing a fair amount of damage, so that's helpful. Oh, this time it actually hit me. Mara should get a couple more levels from there. Six, okay. Power up shield, oh, shield, okay. Mm. All right, wait, if that's the house, yeah, then I think, because I remember passing the house and then over there was where I got the hard hat. Okay, yeah, I think I'm going the right way. There should be a butterfly over here somewhere, too. I think. Not that I need it right now. Uh, no, I think I need to go south? Oh, no. Oh, no. Well... The tree won't kill me, but it's probably going to kill Mara. Actually. That should kill the sprout. Teddy bear. I mean, 
mean, does the teddy bear break? Or... What does prey do? I just noticed. The teddy bear became a pile of fluff. Uh-oh. Oh, I remember now. There was a store... There was a store that sold teddy bears. So her teddy bear has a limited number of uses then. Well, that's not good. Oh no! No! All right, Mara might die. <laughs> Darn it. Okay, hit me. I am stronger. <laughs> What does Prey do? That's right, hit me. A very subtle light engulfed Pin and Mara. Oh, it's a heal! Okay. Oh no. She can't take that much damage. Just die, please. Uh. There we go. Oh, shoot. I have to do it to both of them? Okay. Alright, well, that's good to know. Um, Alright, life-wise, we're okay. Trying to figure out. No, I think I go up this. Oh, wait! Did they fix the bridge? <gasps> you fixed the bridge! I won't say it again. I fixed the bridge. It's a sign of apology. I'm just trying to help. Thank you! Alright. Oh my gosh. You are so kind, sir. Okay. That is gonna be super helpful. I didn't. I thought I was gonna have to go through and do the whole thing again. Awesome. Okay. Alright, it's spinach and not mushrooms, so this should be okay. Let's just get rid of them. Uh, to the front row. Okay. Oh, I probably won't even need to use Mara's. Yep. We're good. Okay. Mara's now level 8. Excellent. Thunder! Okay. Okay, so Mara's a mage, basically. Mage slash healer. Okay. Oh no. Ugh. I don't want to fight the mushroom. I might not have a choice. Just kill it! Yay! Okay. So I need to head to Mara's house, uh, which, oh, it's right here. Okay. Hello. Oh my god. 
gosh, look at her cranky lady. <laughs> I know those feels. It's okay. You know, if I haven't had my coffee or my tea in the morning, I, I know. I can be like that. I can be that way. Okay, here's Mara's house. Yahoo! I knew it! You saved Mara! I don't really understand it, but I know that Mara's miraculous power and your great courage will allow you to stand up to any challenge. Mara, if you must take a trip, be sure to bring this along. It's my very own handmade band-aid. Ooh, that rhymes. I know, we'll call it a hand-aid. Mara got a hand-aid. Did you, did you meet Dad? He is sorry that he suspected that Mr. Everdread of Burgland Park. Alright, so what does the hand-aid do? Nope. Handmade band-aid. It heals your wounded body. Gone after one use. Okay, so not super helpful then. Oh, Mara! Pin, thank you so much! You must be the boy who will save the world, like in Mara's dream. Mara, I'm sure you'd be a big help to Pin. It's not every day a father lets his daughter embark on a journey to save the world. Dad, don't worry about me. Pin and I will be able to take care of ourselves. In three, the next town, we'll meet another friend. Oh, is that what that house was saying? If the three of us can combine our power, no one can beat us. Now wipe your eyes, blow your nose, and smile before we take off. Goodbye, Mara. Don't worry, I won't cry anymore. Okay. So I guess we're heading to Threed now? So what was the point of that other cave then that I saw when I was at Happy Happy Village? Hello? Hello, Pin. Everdred is looking for you. He's got something for you. Okay. Everdred's over here, right? I think he's in this house. Yeah, this is him. I was going to ask you to be my partner, but I know you'll refuse. It's written all over your face. If you accept it, I was going to give you some money. Actually, I can't keep the money now anyway. Let me give this to you. Oh, excuse me? You cannot refuse my generosity, just accept it. Now I plan on looking for the evil Mani Mani statue. That liar exaggerate, ex unearthed it, and on it. I'll see you at another time in another space. Ah. Uh, Mara got a wad of bills? What am I supposed to do with this? A bundle of brand new crisp bills. I feel like maybe there's something I need to do with that. <laughs> I'm not sure what. Okay, so Okay, so three is to the south. Um But I would like to maybe go get Mara another teddy bear. And it wouldn't hurt to get some more food. Which I can also get at the department star store, but and I'll also save there. There's an ATM here, too, so you can get all that stuff done. Oh! What? Did I leave by mistake? Oh, okay. I thought I was, like, hitting a cutscene or something. Alright. Let's take, like, 500. Okay. Nope, didn't mean to check that again. Call dad. Okay. Record. Alrighty, let's head up there. I know I can buy a teddy bear from somebody here. Um, do I also want to get hamburgers? I, they're not the best anymore, although Mara could use them, at least until she levels up.
Oops. Let's get one more hamburger. And is Mara missing? She's missing body, which I don't have right now. Okay. So I need to see if I can get something for her to wear. Shots better? Um, okay. I shouldn't have sold the old one. Yeah, I'll take the frying pan. All right. Oh, wait, nope. So I don't have anything equipped on her then. Um, so wait, are you saying I could have used the teddy bear the entire time on Ness? I didn't have to use it on Mara? Oh well. Okay. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? Okay. And now I head south to Threed. quite finished or figured out what these guys are for either. You're with a girl today. You must be pretty popular. How about introducing her to my bandmate? Uh. Hey, you came with Mara. Then you deserve a present, playboy. Here's a backstage pass. You can get into our shows with this. Mara got the backstage pass. Okay, so what does this do? Oh, hey, it's that dude again. Still not sure what this is for. <laughs> okay. All right, thanks. Let's see. I guess I lost my ticket. Now I can't get in. The ticket counter at the department store was even sold out. You want to see Poochie Fudd, the manager? Right through this door, please. Poochie Fudd. The Runaway Five owe me a lot of money. They'll stay here until they pay me back. Oh! Maybe I need to give him the money. But, all right, wait. Let me see what happens if I go backstage. Hello, please present your ticket. Uh... Here you go. Hurry, you're just in time to see the Runaway 5 show. are bouncing around talking to everyone it's getting annoying well seeing the room five on stage is my life do you like baseball i knew it your cap gave it away a young fan like you really gets into the run away five's music wow i'm impressed lucky of the run away five told me i could go backstage but i don't have a pass hey really you have a pass i can't believe it can you take me with you, please? Please, please, please? I could pose as your sister. Uh... I mean, I didn't say yes? I wrote the lyrics to most of the Runaway 5 songs. Money, that's what I want. Money, that's what is hot. Money, that's what I want. Money, it's what we ain't got. Except freedom, freedom. Freedom is really what we sought. 
Shabba doo wop, diddly da, shabba doo bee, bop wah. I got those debt blues. Mm hmm. If I attend, aha, uh -huh, I could pay off my debts and move on to the next town. It may be rusted out. Oh, I think I see what I need to do. In the old days, there was lots of dancers and acts in this theater. Except now, we're the only act playing here. We even got into debt here, so we're pretty near stuck. Yuck, yuck. The folks of Tucson will enjoy the Runaway 5 show for quite a few years, it looks like, to me. I wonder what I'm supposed to do with the money. Because I have it. I bet you I need to take the bus to, um, Threed. I want some bread. I need the coinage. I want more dough all the time. Alright, well, I... Okay, so I talk to all of them. I'm so excited. I might just wet my... Please don't. My heart is going pitter-patter. Um, am I supposed to leave? Yeah, that's right. Tonight, you got the Chaos Theater Soul Men coming at you. Rockin' and rollin' live on this here stage for a limited time only. The world's greatest blues men, the Runaway Five! And here they come. Oh yeah, baby. Okay, I guess I have to watch their show. <laughs> oh my god, this is great. Do I go backstage again? Hang on. Come in quick. Don't be shy. So what do you think? Do you want to see one more show? No. <laughs> well, I mean, I don't need to see the show twice. Mr. Poochiefoot, the manager, is looking for you. I wonder what he wants. Wait. Okay, well, obviously I have to give him the money. Okay, Poochiefoot. Let's get this over with. Excuse me. I excuse me. Oh, pardon me. Yeah, pardon you. There we go. All right, Poochie Fud. Your name, though. The Runaway Five owe me a lot of money. They'll stay here until they pay me back. They might be here for a hundred years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, maybe I need to... Wait, where is it? Here it is. Excuse me. What's that you got there? Let me take a real close look. The runaway... Uh... What? I still have it. Alright. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> They said he was looking for me. Um. Oh, give? No. Use. Yipes. You surprised me. Now I'm not sure what to do. I got the money, of course, and now the Runaway Five are free to leave. I've got no complaints now that I have my... M I guess I had to talk to him from over the desk, or uh, behind the desk. I've got no... Uh, yeah. Well, what do you know? This little nipper took us from a nightmare to a dream. Oh, this means we can get out of this dump. I'm a good driver. Come on, I'll show you. All right, let's move on to the next town. I'm sure old hunk of junk will get us there. 
I didn't make a spectacle of myself, did I? Alright. I guess we're going with them. Alright, before I go... Let me save. Don't leave without me, please. And here I was thinking that I was going to get all that money. But it's okay. It's fine. I'm sure I didn't need it. Okay. Back we go. Don't hit me. Okay. Let's go to Threed. Our tour bus is too loud for any ghosts to bother us. Wait, what? Ghosts? Let's go. Get on the bus. Okay. Okay, guys, here we go. Hey, sidewalk, get out of my way. Oh, boy. no, the dog! Okay. <laughs> I would have been so sad. I feel like we've been in Tucson for forever. But I guess it's because I haven't recorded in such a long time. Hey, a present! I missed it! Oh well. Oh! I guess this is why I couldn't go to three to... You said the ghosts weren't gonna like you. So apparently the tunnel was haunted. Alright. Looks like we have to say goodbye for now. This town seems pretty gloomy, but I'm sure you can light up the place with your own little brand of sunshine. Hope to see you again sometime. Look for us to be singing some, some theater at some theater in Foreside. Okay, bye. Ooh, this is kind of creepy. All right, can get some pizza. Although I did just buy hamburgers. How am I doing on food? Got a croissant, a croissant, a cookie for some reason. Couple of hamburgers, skip sandwich, bread roll. All right. I don't think those are actually super helpful, but I can come back and get those later. Let's see what the drugstore has. Minor league bat. Ooh, a thick fry pan, but I just bought the other thing. All right, so apparently I've got some good weapons. So I should probably buy those. Let me get some money then. Why am I talking to it? Okay. Um, I'll take another 500. That should be good. Alright, Mara really needs to level. Mara. Yes. I hope I can give it to him. I should be able to. Ooh, nice. Okay. Oh, wait. Let me sell the bat. No, not buy. Okay, sell the sandlot bat. Okay. Now, good 
Kids. Give to Pen. Equip. Minor League Bat. Okay, now I don't think there was any um, defensive equipment for Mara. I still have to figure out where to get that. Cold red uh, toothbrush. I don't know what those do. Alright, let's save. Okay. Now, all right, I do have access to the map. So let's see. There's a hospital, a food, a desert. Some sort of circus tent? Hotel, okay. I guess I have to... I guess I should start talking to people and find out what's going on here. Zombies and ghosts are on the loose here. Welcome to Threed. Well, that's just great. <laughs> um... What am I... Why am I talking to the sign? No pitching of tents in this area without permission. Oh, wow. It's like making magic. The Sims one. Making magic with the... Kind of has that same vibe. How can you smile like that in a dangerous place like this? I, I don't know. Yeah, I worked for the zombies, but I betrayed them too. I'm a con man, so I know the score. Belch gives life to the zombies, but Belch works for Gygus, who I heard might be female. Well, I'm not really sure whether Gygus is male or female. I'm a helpful con man, don't you think? No. I don't know what the heck you just said. You said like three different things and then she Hi! I mean, that was helpful. It just flew right into me. Um. I'm gonna guess that this is... Yeah. Okay. You confront the trick-or-treat kid. Okay. Okay, that well, still doesn't have a ton of health. No idea what I'm supposed to be doing. I should probably go back and talk to some other people. Mars low now level nine. Okay, a snake. Aren't those guys like super low level? Want to escape to the beach? If this is your big dream, come to Carillon Beach in Summers, Summers Tourism Bureau. All right, I haven't been inside this house yet. Oh, no one is here now. Okay. So I did the drugstore. Oh wait, garbage can. No, don't talk to it. <laughs> Darn it. There was just plain old garbage. Okay. All right, so there's the hospital. It's none of your business that we have a small house. Just keep all that whispering quiet out there. Um. Zombies and ghosts are on the loose here, so it can't get to Tucson or Foresight. Maybe the hidden road in the graveyard is safe. No, I'm sure that's not a good idea. Hi, hello? Hi. 
Hi. I overheard the zombies whisper. Master Belch will give us our lives back. Master Belch is the zombie leader. He must be really pukey. Oh no. Not just zombies, but pukey zombies. This is not my favorite. I'm not gonna lie. Reminds me of the good old days in City of Heroes when you're fighting the, um... Oh god, what are they called? The Vazalok? I think it's the Vazalok. And they, like, vomit all over you. Handsome Tom. Nice. Tin of cocoa. Oh, that sounds good. All right, come here, trick or treater. Oh, hey! I don't know how that happened, but I somehow ended up behind him. Nice. All right, he should be dead. I'm sorry, defeated. tried going in here. I'm sorry, I think you ought to leave now. I have no guarantee that you're not a zombie out looking for lunch. I think I see a zombie up ahead. Oh no, that's a mouse. Hey, you don't look so happy. You'd better cheer up or you'll become a zombie. Some people have already become tools of the zombies. Aye! <laughs> a zombie! I'm watching a zombie movie. Can you come by later? Oh. Um, sure. I just have to figure out where I'm going. I am a wimpy little guy, so I can't open the door. You know, it's scary. Okay. Oh, there's the graveyard. I can't imagine this is going to be a good idea, though. No, stop talking to the trash cans, Mystic. Hey, a teddy bear. Sweet. An extra one of those is probably a good idea. Hint shop realization. Oh yeah, this guy. Um, I'm gonna avoid getting a hint for now. I think I'm probably supposed to go to the graveyard. That seems to be what people are pointing me to. So here we are. There's a lot of trash kids! Oh! So they're mimics. Okay. Smelly ghost and its cohort. The putrid moldy man. HP of damage. No! Pin, don't miss! Uh-oh. Oh! Okay, good. Teddy bear became a pile of fluff. I do have another teddy bear, though. Okay. One HP. Come on, die. I might be a little too under level for these guys. Alright. I'm gonna book them. Oh no! should head back to town and uh and and maybe 
save and uh heal this bulletin board greets you this evening all is well good night um no i would say that maybe things are not quite well so where's the hotel here hotel is this way also i think i see some markers bus stop oh is that what that is those markers are a bus stop i saw a suspicious woman talking with the zombies around here yeah i think i'm gonna have to go into the graveyard But I think I'm probably going to do that next time because it does seem like a good stopping point for now. I've been recording this for about two hours. It seems like a good time to stop. So hopefully you guys have a great day and I will see you next time. Bye.